Okay. Everyone wants to take a seat. How was today? Yeah. Okay, so just some housekeeping. I just have a closed message, then we'll be able to hang out the rest of the night. And then tomorrow, water park. But um, abs, I have cutting boards in my car for you before you leave. You uh, <laughs> sure, we'll figure it out. Um, Josh, I have a flatware set. Um, it's from a community kit, but I told it to Cassie. So if you can get it to Danny Lewis or something, she said she would connect with you, but I was afraid to ship a flower box because I'm not to take a break. <laughs> so uh, I have that for you. But uh, so before you guys head out, whether it's today or tomorrow, you grab that. Uh, we're, going, we're cooking out for dinner. So I've got burgers, brats, hot dogs, uh, potato salad. I do need a couple volunteers to go get some more water. Um, so if anyone's Whoever's got a vehicle here, if somebody could just run a couple errands. If, do you guys think we have enough beer, wine, and all that yet? Or do we need more? Curtis? Curtis, do we need more? Thank you, Dale. Thank you, Dale. Does that include the half case outside, too? Okay. So, yeah, so. Okay, so I'll need. We'll come up with a list. Do you think we have enough food? We have five frozen pizzas and a ton of hot dogs and brats. I've got some vegan um, burgers, Sarah, if you're interested. What is that? Uh, or not vegetarian burgers, sorry, not vegan. Black Something, I don't know. I think we have. Oh, diet do, right, Kev? Yeah, probably get some food. Okay, we'll make uh, <laughs> But if I could have somebody with a vehicle and maybe a buddy, so they're not lonely, that'd be great. I'll have to be cooking, so otherwise I'd go. But um, so do you need that? Uh, can I get two volunteers? Kev, talk, you guys got it? Awesome. I'll give you my credit card, Kevin. <laughs> um, there are goodie bags on the poker table that my wife made, so please take one. It's just more snacks, and I think there's a little bottle of sunscreen, especially if you're on the water park. Probably won't be able to fly with it because I think it's like the aerosol or whatever, so I probably can't fly with it. Oh, it's small enough. Okay, cool. So, uh, yeah, take a goodie bag because um, anything that's here, I'm not taking home, um, with the exception of a couple things that my wife said. If there's extras of uh, everything else, I'm not taking. So we either need to eat it or it's going in the garbage or somebody needs to take it home. So, um, yeah, eat, eat, drink, all that. Tomorrow, tomorrow's checkout at 10:30. Okay. Uh, we, Right after that, we're going to the water park. We're going to Mount Olympus. It's close to here. We're just going to buy tickets there. Kind of play it by ear. If you're able to make it, great. If you can't, if you got to get out of town right away, that's fine. Uh, tickets and food tomorrow are on you. Um, we're stressing. No, it's it's just going to be easier that way. So, um, yeah, we'd love for any one of you to make it, even if it's just a couple hours. Um, Q and A's after. No, I'm just kidding. Um, write it down. Um, but at checkout, uh, garbage needs to go in the dumpsters. Uh, I noticed the garbage bin is filling up because we're not doing a great job of recycling. So let's try to recycle the rest of tonight so we can fill up those dumpsters too. <laughs> yeah, let's not do that. Let's actually recycle. Um, dirty dishes have to go in the dishwasher. So that's something we got to do. Um, if you slept on an air mattress, please deflate it when you wake up tomorrow morning. And then... Put it in the blue rab in the garage. Okay? I don't care. The blue rab four. That's my car. Well, my wife's car. Okay? So if you slept on an air mattress, please deflate it. If you're like, hey, these air mattresses were kind of nice and you want to take one home, 70 bucks, you could take the sheets too. That's less than what I pay. If you're interested, I've got I've got six of them that I'd be okay parting with. Otherwise, I'll keep them for next year. But so, if you like the air mattresses, you want one, let me know. Otherwise, they go in my car. Uh, <laughs> furniture just needs to get moved back to how it was placed before we got here. So, just make sure you do that. I think this one just needs to be flipped outside. Pat and Caden, you guys probably knew what it looked like out there. Hopefully. Uh, but yeah, just move it back. And then uh, towels, put them in the laundry room in the basement. We don't have to wash them or anything, but they got to be in the laundry room. In the so, floor, on the floor is great. So, just in a pile.
Any questions about all the housekeeping stuff? Oh, yeah. Vernon, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Do you know how much the tickets are yet? I have no clue. I'm assuming, you did you look it up? I guess, that's what I guess, yeah. Why are we going to know where are? Uh, Mount Olympus has a new water slide and it's the tallest one in the country, in the world. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I want the tallest one. It was called the roof, just in case you know, it's like you're in the middle of the building. Yeah, yeah. They're bringing it out. It's a water park. Why would we want to make it? I don't know if this is a call. So if you guys would rather go to those arguments, so we're actually going to bring 50 dollars. The 50 bucks? Okay. Abs. Like a group raise? If anyone sees the black star warning, then you're Yeah, right? A white black Star Wars shirt. It's ass. Don't take it. Any other questions? Yeah, I just want to say thank you for coming today. Um, thank you for coming today. Thank you for coming today. I have no clue. Not not gonna. We ended up going to Denny's last year because of it, so not in the agenda. Well, we Tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow breakfast on your own. Good yeah. luck. <laughs> any other any other questions? We're good. My only question is, do you mind if they ask anyone driving Madison like at, like uh, tomorrow around today to review the show? Not all. Anyone driving them? Mm -hmm. uh, cool. We're going. We're going. Oh, you are? What time are you guys going? Five thirty. So we're going at the same time. Oh, yeah. There you go. Cool. Okay. If you're going to Milwaukee tomorrow morning, perfect. Yeah. Okay. We'll talk after. Let's close this thing up. Okay. Any any other questions about pack up? No. We're good. Lucky you're good. Yeah. Okay, cool. Awesome. So yeah, so just to close this out here, um, I was thinking about how I want to close. I didn't write my message till this morning, but um, so I was, uh, I went on a run this morning. Um, I'm training for a half marathon. So I was like, I gotta, I gotta get a run in this morning. So I went for a run, forgot about that giant hill. Uh, and I just ran through the cul-de-sacs or whatever that there's two here. Um, and, uh, and then ran down to the construction, but I'm like, I'm not going to try and get hit by some construction vehicle. So I just turned around, figured out it was only two miles ahead of run. So anyway, one of the cul-de-sacs though, uh, well, I saw a deer, it was great. There was hills, it was great. And then all of a sudden I hit one of these cul-de-sacs and all of a sudden I hear a dog barking. I'm like, I got a dog freaking chasing me. Here comes this dog just sprinting. And it was like, I don't know if this dog's excited to see me or pissed off, right? I have no freaking clue. And... I'm like, me personally, as the person running, I'm like, I don't know what's going to happen here. Super cautious. The dog's like full blown. I'm just freaking running off this thing that's in front of my driveway, right in front of my yard. And right now, a lot of people in this company, I think, are acting like the runner, right? Like, you know, we're in election year. I don't know what to expect. You know, events are kind of down right now. I'm like, I don't know what's going to happen, but, you know, let's just try to survive this year. And, you know, it won't be an election year next year, right? And in this moment, we need to be like the dog, right? Like, no matter what comes our way, like, you just need to fucking chase it, right? <laughs> you need to buckle down. Like, I have no idea what's going to happen. Like, yeah, events are down. I think, obviously, we, we had a lot of really good content to hear. Like, here, it's up to you guys to implement that. But it's like, in order to hit our goals, in order to hit our growth goals, it's really up to us. And it's like you have to freaking chase it. Like you have to be that dog. That's like, I don't know what's going to, I don't know what's going to happen. I get hit by a car. Right. But Hey, I'm just going to freaking chase this thing. And I hope I hit it. Right. So it's like, yeah, freaking chase your goal. Like, I don't know what's going to happen. I don't, I don't know what it looks like to hit my goal, but I'm going to freaking chase it. Right. I'm going to do everything in my power to do it. So yeah, I don't know what's going to happen next. None of us do, but I do know one thing. This is the strongest team that we've ever uh, assembled here in central region by far there are a bunch of freaking dogs in this room <laughs> and people people might not yeah people might not know it now but this team will be one of the top teams in the nation if not someday one the top the top team 
right? So, but but really, it's up to you guys. It's up to each. It's up to each of you when that's gonna, when that time will come, right? Every single one of you have to decide to to take on that identity, right? Let's go crush this fair season and prove what we're made of. Let's do it. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.